Keeping up with today's fast-paced world can be difficult. Accelerate your life with iFiber Communications high-speed internet. Surf, stream, and game like never before. Give us a call at 509-754-2600 and find out more at iFiber.tv. The Moses State Chiefs baseball team was finally able to have their first home games of the season when the Eastmont Wildcats came to town. The Chiefs were coming off of a loss against the Wildcats in Eastmont on Tuesday, and they needed to sweep the Wildcats in Friday's doubleheader to take the three-game series. The first game between these two teams was a low-scoring affair. The Chiefs were able to put up two runs in the second inning, and that was all the points anyone scored the entire contest. The Chiefs held on for the win to the zero to even up the series. With the final game on the line, both teams needed a win, and the Chiefs were able to score two runs in the second again, but then they went on to score three more runs between the third and fourth innings to take a solid lead. Moses Lake piled on three more runs in the bottom of the sixth to make the game 8-0, which is what the final score was. The Chiefs took the series two games to one, winning their second conference series of the season. In the second game, junior Dax Lindgren pitched a no-hitter through five innings before being relieved by Gabe Passy, who finished the no-hitter Lindgren started. We practiced really hard, and we turned it up here, we started practicing here, turned that up, and we came ready to play today. The Chiefs advanced to 5-2 and two in the year and 4-1 to one in conference play. They will next play on Monday when they host West Valley of Yakima in a single game. I'm Adam Chikoski. Fry Fiber One Sports. Oh.